Hello and welcome. My name is Timmy and in this video I'll show you how you can use clipping planes to open up new perspectives into your room designs. The tools for creating clips can be found under the Start tab in the Visibility section. Similar to the functions for hiding objects, the cuts are only related to visibility, they do not cut the models itself. There are three different clipping modes available in the menu. If you use the first mode, Plane, the complete design will be cut along a defined line. Define the clipping plane in the Edit mode and with one click the section is cut and you will see the result. You will notice that the cut is only made in the currently active viewport. This enables you to select an individual section from the planning for each workspace. In the second mode, called Region, you can define an area where you want to cut your design. For example, use a two-dimensional view from the side to define the region. If you want to change the defined clipping, you can adjust it at any time by clicking on Edit. Click on Remove to delete the defined region. With the third mode, Volume, a defined section of the design can be easily highlighted. Anything that lies outside the volume will be cut off. Using the various viewports, you can specify the area that is to be clipped. Note that the selected crop will only be applied to the viewport where you started the process. With the button Active, you can always hide and unhide the clipping. Take advantage of the new clipping options to output vector graphics or photorealistic renderings and panoramas. In Pecan Planner Pro, you can also use the sections in the layout area and export them as high-quality PDF documents. Download the latest Pecan Planner version and get started right away. Thank you for your attention and have fun planning and experimenting.